Hello everyone, I'm Hooligan Husky and welcome back to Uncharted The Lost Legacy. Last time, we started things off. We're playing as Chloe and we are in a war-torn city. It's not very pleasant. We're teaming up with Nadine from Uncharted 4. Although this partnership is a little rocky. This chapter is called Infiltration, so I guess we're going to... I'll give you a boost up. Infiltrate. I'm excited. Seems to be a really good game so far. It's very pretty. And right now it's raining. I love it when it rains in games and real life, so... I'm pleased. Just look at this. Follow me! Oh dear. Uh, jumping, yes. Good. <laughs> Whoops! Yep. I believe I mentioned in the uh, the last episode. No. Oh, hold on. Patience. Patience. Lion's bicycle. Okay. Uh, I mentioned how I thought there were twelve <laughs> chapters in this game, but actually really? there are only really only nine. So it's actually even shorter than I thought it was. But they might be fairly long chapters. I don't know. Uh, the fourth game had some pretty <laughs> long, long chapters. Apparently street signs are not the answer as of right now. They might be in a few seconds here, but, you know, sometimes you just have to climb on some street signs. And actually, that is about- that's exactly what's about to happen. Careful on this one. <laughs> no. I didn't really mean to do that. I'm wanting to vault. Leap! Over! Vaulting and leaping. Uh, Lion's bicycle. Reminds me of Lion King. Okay. We're we're definitely making our way. Here's some more laundry. Uh, put out to dry, but unfortunately, I think it's just getting even wetter. Oh. Okay. Looks like we're gonna do some shimmying. This way. You realize we're moving away from the salt stain. Yeah, we're taking the long way. Now I'll see why you always like. <gasps> hey, there are no shortcuts in life, all right? Sometimes you gotta go the long way around. And jump onto a street sign. Cause that's just what you do in life. Oh wow. Okay. <gasps> Stealth grass. I'll take him out. No, I got it. Oh sure, I got it. Because why not? Copy that cobra one. At least it's just the one, right? Well, where to now? Up. Okay. Up and up. Oh boy. Okay. There's a treasure, I see it. Apparently. Crate controls are still something I struggle with. I don't know why. What? I guess I'm pulling it over here. Although Nadine is... No, never mind. She's fine. Okay, before we go up, let us collect this treasure. It's... Is that a... Oh. Oops. Wrong button. Yeah, it is a lighter. Okay, interesting. Up and up we go. What a lovely night. If you just ignore the desolation of the city and the burning fires and explosions that are happening in the background, it's really quite a pleasant night. The moon is shining, the rain is pouring. Just exploring our options. Sit tight. Yeah, Nadine, chill out. He'll be fine. We'll all be fine. Oh, wow. She dropped lower than I was expecting. Well, she certainly lives up to her reputation. Oh, another crate. Interesting and convenient. Where are we pulling this one? Are we just going even farther up? Here we go. Is this 
is good enough. Oh. Maybe not. It also looks like we need to be climbing over across the next building. Okay, I don't think I can actually get on top of that, so... I understand completely now. This is why sometimes it pays to look around and explore your options, as Chloe just said. Sometimes you have to get on the other side of the crate. <laughs> okay. I'm so sorry, Nadine. I did not know that would happen. I thought... Okay, well, that's one way to do it. Uh, yeah, 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 fine. <laughs> no, 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 you didn't hear anything. It's just the rain doing soundy things. That's what you're hearing. Oh, the pink lighting from the neon signs. It's amazing right now. Ooh, that creates a nice Some effect. Supplies, if you want them. You're always this company on the job. <laughs> yeah. Good. We love ourselves some dialogue, right? So where are the voices that we heard? Maybe they're up top? <laughs> Everywhere except where I was looking, of course. Well, it's okay. We, we can take care of this easily. No problem. Look at that pink lotus. So cool. It's so bright and pink. It's just above us. See? That wasn't so bad. It wasn't. I mean, I guess it could have been worse. Although Nadine's... Probably not happy about having a crate dropped on her. <laughs> oh. Sorry, Nadine. Although I sort of maybe shouldn't feel bad because <laughs> she was the villain in the last game. Look at you already up here. So just take a moment. Ooh. More lock picking. There's one. Okay, you got that one. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that works. Yes, that is. <laughs> that also works. Okay, I kind of like Nadine when she's not on the much. other side. Watch our backs, yeah. Yeah. Crossed. It's like walking through an antique shop. He's been a busy boy. How much do you think it's all worth? Enough to keep his little insurrection going for quite some time. Huh. So this Asav? He's been collecting oh, lots of curious cats here. Speaking of Tiger pelts. Good point. It doesn't bother you. These are all Indian artifacts. It's not my fight. Hmm. 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 Okay. He's been collecting so many artifacts. But why? Salah and the tiger. Maybe he's closer than I thought. Hmm. So what is Chloe after? Well, what? What's Chloe and Nadine both after? Cause no one will miss this. Chloe, at least, doesn't seem to be taking sides in this war that's going on. She doesn't care. She just wants to complete her job. But there's got to be some ulterior motive. Why is she getting into this? Guess we'll find out sooner or later. I'll just borrow this. Ooh. Maybe it's that Present. thing. Me. <laughs> Maybe. That looks promising. It's locked. Not for long. What a cool window. Cool view. I mean, a, a terrible view because of what's going on, but I mean, it looks cool. Okay, let's unlock this box. And find out all its secrets. Where's that map? Western Ghats, Wesala territory. No, it's all right. Nothing we didn't already know. 
Okay, just a little more. <laughs> it's okay, we got it. Fingersmith. Ooh, that would be really bad. Okay. Dean Ross. What a pleasant surprise. Ah, ah, careful, brothers. This tiger's got claws. You, he collects tiger pelts. Oh, all these years. And you haven't aged a day. You too can't. <laughs> Are you looking for work? I hear that shoreline's under new management. Temporary setback. Nothing I can't handle. Of course. Of course. Pity, though. My men and I could use someone of your caliber. Why are you here? I mean, this... This isn't your area of expertise. It, it is a nice collection, I must say. Chloe Fraser, collector of antiquities. A thief? You're working for a thief. Sir, we have a situation. <gasps> I'll be right there. The disc. Oh, right, about that. At first, I mistook you for just an average rebel. Oh. But you have managed to find the Hoysala Empire. That's not bad. Their greatest treasure, the Tusk of Ganesh. Now, that's not an easy find. What are you doing? Three Persian invasions, three separate wars, and all these years later, no one has found it. We're close. You're lost. And the only chance you have of even narrowing down its location is to find someone who can help you crack this artifact. Someone with an extensive knowledge of Hoysala society. Exactly. Mm. An expert in their culture and history. My rates are reasonable. A parasite who exploits our struggle in order to fatten her pockets. Hmm. So that's a no. Felt like a no. <laughs> You've got balls. I like that. But I don't need any more so called experts. Shoot them, throw their bodies in the river. No need. We'll throw ourselves out. <laughs> Okay, okay. We need to get across the river. That escalated quickly. Ooh, in the rain, it's a downpour. Slide away. Go. Okay. Oh, uh, just I'm just running. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, uh this is probably Ooh, do I? I don't. I don't think this is. This is good. Okay. <laughs> okay. You know when when the main character says this way, you know you're going the right way. So good, good. All right. Quick. Is Nadine with us? Where is she? Maybe she's, she's probably way ahead. Oh, there she is. What the hell was that back there? Messy but effective. You were uh, going to sell me out, weren't you? It's called improvisation. God, who's being unprofessional now? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you let Asav get the jump on us. I'm starting to wonder whether you're worth the 50%. I knew it. You were going to give me up. Guess a leopard can't change her spots. You know nothing about me. Fair warning. Last person who betrayed me wound up dead. There's your river. Yeah? And your guy better be there. Yeah, well, time to 
go. Come on. I mean, what Nadine says is true. Rafe is most certainly dead after he betrayed her. Oh, this is dangerous. You don't say. Okay. Right, right, right. Oh. Okay. Don't worry about this. We, we can take them. Teamwork! Alright. Street signs! Save me! <laughs> Come on, go, go, go! Okay, just. It's fine, it's, it's fine. I meant to jump, I'm so sorry. Ah. Uh. Just keep moving, keep moving. Don't stop! Keep moving! That's right! This is going great! Please stop pouring rain! Uh. I mean, it's- it's- it, it is? Follow me. We're doing good, right? Lights, lights, lights! What? Drop me a line! That is gorgeous. How are we going out there? On schedule. Should hit land in about an hour. Great. No wonder the whole solar capital was ransacked. Look at this thing. Any luck? I don't need luck. I'd say we can use all the luck we can get. Are you still hung up on the Sarv's so-called expert? Don't worry. If a Sarv's not in the gets already, he'll be right on our heels. Plus, he's got weapons, transports, hundreds of men. Like I said, don't worry. Looks like some kind of key. Maybe. Let's see. Okay. The trident was Ganesh's weapon. The bow and arrow was Parashurama's. And the axe was a gift from Shiva. Great battle. What? The battle in which Ganesh lost his tusk. I bet we find these symbols. We find the tusk. Not bad, Fraser. Yeah, well. He liked my dad for that. Hindu myths were his thing. Might have rubbed off. He must be proud. <laughs> Sun's almost up. I'll go get ready. Nice work. It's a long way to go to settle an argument. Just for my peace of mind, all right? <laughs> well, nice view. And look. How weird. I'm sorry I doubted you, Chloe. Is her Salah? Hoi Salah. It's not a modern structure, so we're definitely on the right track. 
What? I don't like it. You don't like anything? No. We've gone nearly a hundred kilometers with no sign of us off. Glass half full, maybe we got the jump on them. Unlikely. I'll find the tusk. Asav's on you. Understood. Need you back at the car. Yep. What a beautiful place. Homecoming. Ah, right where I left it. Okay, so we have some vehicle driving. Oh, landscape. absolutely. Take a photo. Let's see it. Nice. Yeah, I'm always up for a beautiful jungle with a sunset. I mean, sun. well, actually, it's probably sunrise. It, it is a sunrise. I don't know why I said sunset. But, yeah. Birds and the trees and the fog. Oh, it's so beautiful. Okay, well, I'm really liking this so far. And we're only two chapters in. And there's already a lot of intense action going on. That's great. I love it. Um, I think it's really interesting because, you know, with Nathan Drake's adventures, he was always doing it for the... Well, he was doing it for himself. Yeah, he was a thief just like everyone else, but he had morals. You know, he, he was good. He was stealing treasure, but he was also making sure that no one else evil was stealing it and ending the world or anything like that. But yeah, it's interesting because Chloe, she's kind of like, she'll do anything to get what she wants morals tossed aside like she was about to sell Nadine out to achieve her goal so yeah it's interesting we've got a kind of a bit, a bit of a different character going on here another thing I thought it was interesting how Asav he called Nadine a tiger and then we saw that he collected tiger pelts like there might be some sort of double meaning there and that just ew, Asav seems like a mildly gross guy okay well, yeah, I'm, I'm really enjoying this. Next time, we are going to go to the car and drive around the jungle and find the Tusk of Ganesh. Well, it probably won't happen that quickly, but we're going to get on our way. See you guys for that. But until then, goodbye.